I'm Godzilla. Hey, I'm Godzilla too. Hmm. Godzilla. Godzilla. It's not fair. Definitely uh, interesting to find see more of that old lady duck. But hey, how's everyone doing? Just a toy hunting, thrifting, you name it, trying to find good deals, find cool things, light unique things, you know, 80s, 90s, vintage, retro, anything just cool and odd, whatever, board games, toys, you name it, video games. I mean, look at this. Shame there's no Leo. But anyway, <laughs> uh, hope you just enjoy this. You still get the McDonald Racer Barbie. Still weird stuff. And uh, this was the biggest thing. A Godzilla puppet from 1998. Look at that. Well, you can't. But I can. <laughs> oh my gosh. I mean, it's so cool. Oh my gosh. Of course. I think that's a Taco Bell one there. I uh, just don't know why we're passing. I know he works, but... Uh, um, yeah. Don't forget to, uh, you know, like and uh, comment and subscribe and all that. Yeah. Good times, good place. Yeah. Right? <laughs> uh, but, oh, the 1998 Godzilla stuff, just when it kind of popped in my head recently about some of those things, suddenly there's that a, a place that's having all, but it's so expensive for that i'm like you can get it cheaper that's not so you can find it cheaper on ebay and they don't guarantee that the thing works but for like half the price they were charging i'm like <sighs> good condition but wow they are charging double the price and uh again the brooke shears thing it's like that was really weird to see wouldn't you think like a dress up dolls for they had brooke shield dolls what the heck weird but look at all this like random stuff like a uh, mishmash of everything and then Skittleball? <laughs> Monster Maniacs? What the hell? 15. What the hell is a Monster Maniac? Sam's happy birthday and... Oh god. Happy happy birthday. We're really glad you came. Happy happy birthday from the birthday king. And a Best Buy with a Christmas hat. <laughs> Aw. He's protecting them. He's protecting the little girl. <laughs> you remember Gurgi? Her oh, Gurgi. Nobody likes Gurgi. I love Gurgi. In fact, there's two Gurgi. Come on, you can't pass up stuff like this. Get two Gurgi. And that interesting Barbie, these old toys. Ah, so many cool things though, but ah, oh, Godzilla, why? Ah, and then a Queasy Bake Oven. <laughs> Anyone have these? Comment below if you ever did. Even if it was the Easy Bake Oven. I know my sister and stuff like that did that. Never had an interest in a Queasy Bake. I know there was the uh, Creepy Crawler and stuff, but. Never heard of a Queasy Bake till nowadays. Disney Princess Yahtzee. The box art looks nice. They all look nice in those dresses, but, you know, it's just Yahtzee. And then I've seen that friend stuff everywhere, the trivia game. I would only be the only one probably good at it, besides my sister. <laughs> and an awesome find that my buddy found. Might pick this up. Hmm. <laughs> and again, I just love, look at the art on that. So creepy and cool. And then, what's this? Another interesting find. Hmm. And, uh, yo! There's Alf back there. I just thought that was cool to see some weird Alf thing hiding back there. Some Mr. Potato Heads. More of the princesses there. I like these ones here. Her shame her neck is broken. But, you got feet on the bottom of these. That is always very weird. He looks real creepy with his teeth right there. Oh my gosh, I love, uh, Winnie the Pooh, The Search for Christopher Robin. I loved that movie back in the day. Oh, when I was a kid, that was one of my favorite films. That's a cool guy. So those glasses were awesome. Did you have those? Yellow Ranger. Oh, this is the new stuff, I think. Maybe? I don't know. Tattoo included? Let me not. No, 94. 
Oh, there's the cool monsters. Ah, there's the pig, there's the bull, there's that shark, there's that chicken. There's the eye guy, there's the snake guy, there's the bee guy, there's the turkey guy, there's the tarantula guy. Oh, I hate all those. $32. I don't care about the little head flipping thing, it's in package, so. And then dinosaurs, 25, aww. What a shame. Hey, poppin' fresh. <laughs> so what does he do? You wind him up in the back. I have one hand. Where am I supposed to wind it? Okay, it's not working. It's got a lot of resistance. Oh, what a shame. But it's cute. See that? It shouldn't be on that, Six though. o'clock. Oh, you're right. <laughs> hey, what time is it? <laughs> Six o'clock. Yeah. <laughs> I just had to. There was a, a dial there, and then there was that poo thing there, and... Yeah, I know. It's a big one. <laughs> it was too much to pass up. And then, you know, McGruff, the crime dog. Hey, Bert. <laughs> hey, Bert. <laughs> That's pretty neat. Oh, the chumps. Look at their hair. I like that they have hair. What? This place had a lot. I don't know if it was nice to just pass up on some stuff, but Turtle Comics there, that's okay with that, but Jeopardy on Tiger Electronics? Jeopardy? What? And then these were expensive, but it was cool to have that. I had that. I had that Jeep. I don't know which one of these figures I have, but I have that Jeep and that uh, copter. That's so cool. And then Rupert. Anyone remember Rupert? I love the cartoon show back in the day. It was on Nickelodeon all the time, Nick Jr., whatever. And that's pretty interesting. I mean, it looks just like it, the art a little bit. I'm wondering, uh, did the badger front of us have a... Yeah, he had a sister, I guess, because that didn't look like him right there in the blue. But look at all this. I really enjoyed Rupert. Let me know in the comments below if you remember Rupert or any of these other shows at that time, if you remember some of the uh, ones that you would consider still good to say. I've watched a couple recently and still enjoy it. And that looks really good, that art in there. Of course, Spice Girls, there's a whole bunch of dolls of those. Star Trek, there's a lot of Barbie stuff everywhere again. And I don't know, there she is with Kirk. And uh, this, uh, Dallas Cheerleaders. Hey, hey, over here, notice me. Go on, hey, yeah, yeah, over here. She's waving. I'm waving. We're waving. Notice us. She's not noticing us. Come on, over here. She's looking the other way. Come on. I mean, their hands are out. They're waving. We're all... Santa Dentist? thought that was just really pretty artwork. 1940s doll case. It's like Puppet Master, only without the cool puppets. They kill for you. And this was a cool find. Look at all the toppers from, what, Phantom Menace? Oh my gosh. I don't care. And then that guy, I forgot their names. I remember Jar Jar. <laughs> Decently priced. They look good condition. I think they were $20 a piece. At least Jar Jar, when I looked at him, was 20 And then look, Godzilla and VHS for $1. I don't know why my, my obsession is that day, but there was Godzilla 98 stuff everywhere. <laughs> and I couldn't, and I decided on, uh, just a lot of it was too expensive. But I love the art on the Betty Boops there. This is a very cool lunchbox. She looks good there, and I love that one there with the driving. It's very cool, my buddy is a big fan. And this, that type of poster, I forget what that's based off of, but it looks so creepy to me. Because that's the mascots in like a drawn form. And it isn't them as cartoons, but it's the mascots as cartoons. Something is a little eerie about it, a little uncanny, something about it. But again, what do you think of it? I think it looks pretty neat though. It's expensive though. And then these things are always a treat. Uh, I mean, again, there's nothing wrong with it, but, I mean, I just think it's funny. Lay off, uh, this at, uh, decently priced, but, oh, dear God, what is that? Why would you have that mug? Lay off the private stuff. What is that thing? Oh, my gosh, I'm, like, so scared now. I can't even, I, I, I can't even anymore. I'm gonna have to get out of here. Uh, uh, I don't even know where to go. How do I get out of here? It's like a maze. It's like a maze. Okay, I'm out. Moving about. And, okay, okay, there's something here. Hey, look at that. More Bert and Ernie. We're safe. <laughs> hey, everyone. How you doing? Don't forget. You know what to do. Yeah. Have fun. Boop. And here we are. That was it for the antique store. Always some interesting stuff there. We don't go there too often, but we do. It's neat. Shame the disc on that was totally scratched up. We're at Goodwill now. This thing here, my buddy said he remembered that as a kid. His brothers and sisters had it. Fun little thing there. A bit on the pricier side, but hey, there we are. <laughs> 
And uh, this in here was pretty neat, where you draw, you slide the thing there. He remembers that, too. I feel like I vaguely remember something like this. There was chalk in there. It's cool to see these old things, and when they're not bad. And look, that Elsa, the Elsa head, her hair just looks really cute up like that. So it's like, I don't know. More Elsa stuff. Not damaged. She just looks very cute. I'm telling you, Godzilla everywhere. <laughs> but here we are now at a V-stock, a vintage stock. And oh my gosh. The Pharaoh attempt on his throne pop figure as we continue the day. And th that just looks so cool. Finally someone out in the wild. And I see she's still here. <laughs> she's still here. I don't see a price tag on her anymore. So I'm like, oh no, is she no longer for sale? Maybe one day we'll bite the bullet and put her somewhere. I don't know where. <laughs> but uh, all the pop figures, always the pop figures, and a Turbo Man doll. And I saw this Bucky O'Hare. It's nice that they finally gave one to the female characters, which they rarely did back in the day for a lot of stuff. But I'm like, why would you get rid of this? And this also goes, oh no, I forgot. We need to show off a lot of our Bucky O'Hare stuff we got for Christmas. Christmas in July, maybe? Soon. This was really neat. I don't know, I tried presser, I don't think she worked, but maybe you can get some tweaking there. But ten bucks for this, and this is old. Tempting. Ah, Crash Bandicoot Coco, ah, love that. And look, even here, Godzilla 98 stuff. In this whole area, was someone went to different places and dropped off Godzilla stuff from 98. Fifteen bucks, though. I'm like, ooh. Cool, but no. And look, you remember that. He transformed to Hulk one time, remember? <laughs> yes, Neville, you had the power to leave my store. <laughs> and the Darkness Girl is still 100 bucks and still there. Jeez. I love uh, the little comic posters they have throughout where the comics are. Good stuff. Looks really cool. <sighs> Back when comics were okay. And this, another issue of Godzilla Power Rangers. What a neat mashup. I saw this the other day. And now I'm actually I'm just going to take a peek in there. It's so like, the art doesn't look too bad. And it looks pretty like, wow, what's going on in here? I might actually want to check into this because it's two awesome mashes. God, I mean, look at that right there. That panel right there. Off. Oh. And this, wow, they still have uh, stuff like this? Ooh, pretty good art right there. And then Elvira meets Vincent Price. How can this be on five? And I had never heard of this till five. I got catching up to do. And, uh, ooh, still, some good art in there. And I like that in this I saw there was, like, Vincent Price dressed up as Sherlock Holmes. Yeah, right there. Interesting. Ah, oh, that seems like a good mashup. And, of course, this always looks cool. I forgot the name of it, but the style looks very nice, and I'm glad that they're doing well with it, and that looks interesting. <laughs> and, of course, Last Ronin is done. I think it turned out pretty well. And, of course, that's it. Very cute. Love the design. Hey, how you doing? Uh, very cute design there. And I had to get a shot of that before we went. And yeah, that is the end of our journey. Thanks for joining us for this. And now let's look back and see if there's anything we did get. <laughs> we also got this. Yes, you've seen in the video. That is what we have decided to get. Because it's cool. A little Esmeralda, Esmeralda and Phoebus <laughs> uh, place set there. So they look cool. Hunchback, I think it's still that Hercules, and besides, obviously, Frozen are my favorite. And Mulan, those are probably my favorite. Emperor's New Groove, I don't know, those are like my top five. Did I say five or is it six? Either way, favorite Disney movies. So that was a neat find. They look like they're pretty good condition. The box is a little what it is, but they still look pretty good. I don't know if we can get a better, better angle, better shot of them and their faces, and they look pretty good. Not too bad. Speaking of, we also got the other play set. Uh, Anastasia. 20th Century Fox presentation deluxe gift set. There's the artwork of them on the sides. Posable figures from the animated adventure. Yes, posable figures. Animated adventure. There's a frame. Picture. There's those guys. There's a book. And there's even that guy. Bartok? Bartok, right? There's the dog. And there, uh, yeah, there she is. And it's pretty neat. They were nicely priced, so we figured why not. Anya Wapuka, Dream Waltz Anastasia, Paris Elegance Anastasia. Ooh. Collect all the puzzle figures. Bartok, I was right. <laughs> Let's 
So yeah, pretty darn cool. And besides these, we did get some more uh, Disney themed things. Take a look at this. Why aren't you guys talking about me? It's me, Mushu. All right, cool. So yes, I couldn't get the Godzilla finger puppet or the other Godzilla because they're just too pricey at the time until the sales come for VSOC and then uh, do we get something? We'll see. Maybe, maybe not. But Mushu's cool. This was pretty neat. He was like a buck. I'm like, whatever. I don't care. I can fit my thumb and I'm giving you a thumbs up with uh, Mushu. Yeah. Don't forget to Mushu thumb up this video there, everyone. It lets us know that you care and watch and stuff and comment. Well, he's here. Yeah, why'd you do that? <laughs> he was pretty cool. And then speaking of Disney again, I don't know, this was old. And it was a buck. I think it was 75 cents. That was what was weird about it. It was a weird price. It was either a buck or 75 cents. Either way, couldn't complain. Uh, Mickey Mouse, Donald Duck, it's just a cheap bag of checkers and you should know me by now if you look at our game videos I'm not a fan of checkers <laughs> but this is more for a collectible thing I probably won't take this out because it looks old I mean it's like rubbing off and broken and you can see how like that is but it's pretty neat you got Donald and Mickey on there I would be team Donald because Donald's my favorite but that was pretty neat I thought and then speaking of more stuff like that couldn't pass on this because eh, I like the art on it. Look at that. That's pretty cute. That's pretty sweet. Good old bugs. Forever friends. Friends. Is that what we're doing here? Friends. It doesn't look like friends. <laughs> Good old Lola. She Lola's awesome. Uh, I don't like how it's like a crayon type of scribblings with the hearts and everything around it. And yes, there is a music to it. Uh, 1997. Merrily we roll along. Oop, there you go. And yes, it opens up. I mean, I guess I could crank it. Probably better that way, right? It's always neat when they actually work. So I was like, why not? Oh, showing a little bunny tail at us. But wasn't that cool? I thought it was kind of neat. So yeah, pretty neat. Whoop, there we go. Get her a little bit there. Maybe we can get a better shot of her. No, not Esmeralda. Here we go, Lola. I said not Esmeralda. Not even Phoebus. She was cute. That's pretty cool. So uh, it'll go with our cool Elsa one. We'll close it up. And it was just neat. I think it was only a couple bucks. So why not? Yeah. <laughs> Mommy. I got the dirty thumb. Yeah, I do. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at that. Saw this on the little things there. Had to get this one out of all of them. I love... Robin Hood, Disney Robin Hood is so cool. And look, Prince John, that phony king of England. This little crown. Look at that face. <laughs> he is so cool. Like, I wonder uh, what year this would be. We'll take a look and we'll find out. But look, he's got his little robe. He's got his little crown. He's furry on the sides on his chin. <laughs> I assume there's no Robin Hood or Little John or Sir Hiss or something. Stop hissing in my ear. <laughs> he actually sits pretty nicely on there. I'm impressed. I thought he was going to fall over, but no. He is ready to show off his awesomeness. His royal uh, swagger. Mm, yes. Mommy. <laughs> I love it. That is so cool. Isn't it? Yeah. Thanks, Snap. <laughs> At least you care, Snap. That's right, friends. Awesome. And look, you even get the little 
little spot things you can see that are on there as I was looking for them. That's pretty cool. Good material. Made exclusively for, he's got like purple bloomers underneath, little sandals. And it says on the tag, way up there, whoa, YouTube friendly? <laughs> it says Robin Hood, and it even tells you who it is, but you should know who Prince John is. That phony king of England. What, it's a catch a song. Well, what was nice too is this was just sitting there, and I know this is something they pass out for things, but we got this for free. Score one for getting some deals today. Let's take a look at it. Ain't that neat? Nice and free. Free. Who's your favorite of, of the starters? Is it Pikachu? Technically he is. So it's a neat little poster, and we'll just do this to kind of get somewhat of a cool thing going. Pretty neat for free. All, uh, makes up for some of the other stuff that happened while searching for deals, bargains, and good stuff. And yes, there's one of the Elsas, as you can see. Hey. Hey. As you can see, just really neat, nice hair. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, so what are you looking at? What the? Elsa. <laughs> Elsa's looking up at the world. I know, she just has the cute hair. Don't she? Yeah, look at that, look at that, look at that cute hair up like that. <laughs> She's always looking that way at you. Very cute. Got her cute Elsa's. Wow! Don't forget to tell everybody about our next awesome adventure, starring me. Do it now. <laughs> oh, Elsa. Still looking. Then we got this. We'll probably get a better shot of her, but a sneak peek. She was pretty cool, pretty cheap. V-Sock, of course, the person who had her was a little, uh, kept her a little dusty, you can see. I don't know if you get a good shot of, like, how there's, like, somewhere, like, you really gotta rub on her head a little bit. You really need to dust her off just a little bit, you know what I'm saying? I don't think it's coming off. But don't worry, next time. Tune in next time to find out more awesome deals. Yeah, next time. Ooh, ooh. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you next time. Stay gnarly.